Lewis Hamilton has already received two F1 retirement approvals. At the current time of writing, Lewis Hamilton's future remains shrouded in uncertainty. The seven-time F1 title winner has refused to say whether he'll return to the grid in the wake of his heartbreaking defeat to Max Verstappen in Abu Dhabi. And he's already received two green lights to retire from two Formula One figures. Hamilton was just one lap away from winning a record eighth F1 title that would have moved him ahead of Michael Schumacher in the history books. Yet the Stevenage born racer ended up missing out on glory to Verstappen, with an incident involving a safety car ultimately preventing him from moving out in front. In the immediate aftermath of the chaos in the Middle East, Hamilton fueled speculation over his future by saying we will see about next year. He's kept a low profile ever since, only just returning to social media. And with Hamilton's future still up in the air, it'll be interesting to see what the Mercedes star decides to do. Many still want the 37-year-old to continue racing, especially as he remains at the very top of his game. But two figures within the sport have expressed a belief Hamilton should quit the sport. Bernie Eccleston, speaking in December, said the Brit was unlikely to return. And, what's more, the F1 icon also said that he would understand if Hamilton called time on his racing career. I don't think he is coming back, I think he will not race next year, he said. His disappointment in Abu Dhabi was too great, and I understand him. Now, tied for seven titles with Michael Schumacher, it is the perfect time for him to fulfill his dream and be a fashion entrepreneur. A couple of days ago I spoke with his father, and I realized immediately that he did not want to talk about the future of his son, so we just talked about business. Eccleston isn't the only person who thinks retirement would suit Hamilton. Williams boss Jost Capito recently insisted he didn't care whether the Mercedes star continued racing or not. But he did suggest it would be a good move for the 37-year-old because it would allow the next generation of F1 drivers to step up and rise to the fore. I don't really care whether he drives or not, he said last week. It's totally irrelevant, really totally irrelevant. They always say there are not enough places for young drivers and then I think, if someone has been world champion seven times, he has actually done enough and could make room for a youngster, why not? While those two figures have said Hamilton should retire, however, the majority of figures within the sport feel he needs to return. Red Bull chief Christian Horner, speaking recently to Wyan, said, I certainly hope Lewis will be around this year. He's still driving at an incredible level, the two drivers last year were in a league of their own. But ultimately, it's his choice, it's his career, it's his decision, so I'm sure he will decide what's best for him, what he wants to do, and that's none of our business. And Verstappen, despite the fierce nature of his rivalry with Hamilton, also thinks he'll return for another crack at glory. Normally, Lewis has to come back. Verstappen told Service TV last month. Those words came to my mind after the race, but I think for him it was a normal emotional reaction. So I count on him coming back.